Hello guys, Nathan here, and today we're looking at how to install MyTest Mods on your Android device. So of course, firstly, you will need to have MyTest installed on your Android device. You can find MyTest on either Google Play Store or on F-Droid. You can also download a slightly more recent build by going on the forums and going to the builds, and there's a few here for Android, specifically that one right here. Um, so you'll need that downloaded, and then you'll need some mods. So of course we will be looking at the mods here. I'm just going to randomly grab one, and you know what, I, um, I picked the wrong, picked the wrong section. I wanted mod releases. Um, depending on the the age of your device and the processor and RAM that you have and everything, it is going to affect which mods you can run and actually have them perform. Because some mods, such as say home decor, not so simple mobs, um, and various other ones, they're going to have too much just everything and your device won't be able to hold it or not hold it it won't be able to handle it you now of course if you have like say an nvidia tablet or something you'll probably be just fine so we just downloaded the mod here and then of course as always we might have to rename things in this case we are in a zip folder here so let me actually go go back the downloads to the downloads so we'll go what? That's not what I said. I wanted downloads. Here we go. And we have XD Core Master Zip. So we will go ahead and extract that right away. It'll take a second to extract. We have an XD Core Master, which has XD Core Master inside of there. So what we're going to need to do is rename. Now I am using the Amaze File Explorer. Um, any file explorer should work as long as it gives you the ability to copy and paste. So we're just going to rename this file as it should be named. I'm just double checking that that is actually the parent directory you want and not the higher up one. And we will go ahead and copy that. And then we are going to browse to the my test location. Now I've already made a bookmark for it. And in my case, you can see here it's in storage SD card O mine test. Uh, it could be different on your device. That, unfortunately, I can't tell you exactly what it's going to be. And, of course, you'll find the mod folder here. That's where we're going to want to paste it. As you can see, I've already put in Compass GPS. And we'll just click on the little clipboard icon there to paste. And give it a second. And it's pasted in. We will go ahead and launch mine test now. and it'll run through everything and now we can go to the mods tab and we'll see we have compass gps and we have x decor here to actually enable the mods though we have to do configure mods and turn them on right here now you may have an issue such as i did you'll notice right now that i'm kind of getting some clipping going around the border and i don't get the full buttons but i have enough showing where you can actually cl uh, click on them and stuff. If you go to your settings, you have down here in this bottom corner a GUI scale factor. Just adjust that to you get to a point where you can actually see your buttons that you need, such as the enable tier and cancel and save down at the bottom. And then we just start single player and let it create the server and load all the media. Um, and load the media, and load the media, and initialize the nodes. Now unfortunately I don't know craft recipes for anything for these mods that I just added. So I, I don't really know if they're working. Um, but there I dropped some items, which that would be the item drop mod. Uh, I honestly don't know I've always had so much trouble getting 
this whole thing to work. There's something where you gotta split it up by doing something. And like pinch outward to split it. And evidently that's not a recipe, which is honestly no surprise. But that's pretty much how you install mods on an Android device. So hopefully that was helpful to some of you guys. If you would like me to do more my test videos on Android for different things, let me know in the comments and I will see what I can do. Catch you next time.